Seeing your baby for the first time on an ultrasound screen is one of the most magical moments of pregnancy. But there's a lot more to these scans than just pictures. In this video, I'll walk you through why we do ultrasounds, when, how they work, the safety facts you should know, and how they help your baby's health. Let's go! Part 1. What is an ultrasound? Ultrasound, also called sonography, uses sound waves, not radiation, to create images of the fetus inside the womb. A technician moves a device called a transducer over the mother's abdomen, or in early pregnancy sometimes via transvaginal, and those sound waves bounce back, forming a live image on screen. Unlike X-rays, this method is non-ionizing, so there's no radiation exposure. It's widely used and considered a safe procedure when performed by qualified professionals. Part 2. When are ultrasounds done? First trimester, around 6 to 8 weeks to confirm pregnancy, seeing the heartbeat, estimating due date. Around 11 to 13 weeks, sometimes to check nuchal translucency, part of Down syndrome screening. Anatomy scan, 18-22 weeks a detailed scan of organs, limbs, spine, placenta, etc. This is often the most detailed routine scan. Later in pregnancy, additional ultrasounds may be done if there are concerns, such as growth issues, positioning of the baby, placenta health, amount of amniotic fluid. Part 3. What do doctors look for? Ultrasounds allow the medical team to measure growth, head size, abdomen, femur, to see if the baby is growing normally. Check anatomy, brain, heart, kidneys, spine. To detect any congenital anomalies early. Evaluate the placenta and umbilical cord, word attaches, whether there is any issue with blood flow. Assess fluid levels around the baby, baby's position, important for delivery. Part 4, 3D or 4D ultrasounds and fun views. Beyond plain 2D imaging, 3D and 4D ultrasounds give more lifelike images. You'll see baby's face, fingers, movements, sometimes even yawns or smiles. These are often elective, for bonding. However, medical associations advise they be used when medically necessary and by qualified professionals since they typically aren't covered by insurance and sometimes come with more cost. Part 5. Is ultrasound safe? Myths versus facts. Ultrasound has excellent safety record, it's been used for decades with no evidence of harm to fetus or mother when done properly. Because it's sound waves, non-ionizing, there's no radiation risk like X-rays. Bio-effects such as slight heating of tissues or tiny mechanical effects are possible in theory, but in practice with regulated equipment and qualified staff, no harmful effects have been shown in human studies. Advice from medical authorities, use ultrasound only when medically indicated, avoid unnecessary keepsake ultrasound scans outside of medical settings. Part 6. How to prepare and what to expect. Drink water before early scans if required, some need a full bladder for clearer images. Wear comfortable clothing that allows access to abdomen. During scan, you may feel pressure when transvaginal or cold gel on abdomen. Not painful. Expect to see baby's movements, hear heartbeat, see images, sometimes 3D face. You may get printed pictures. Sometimes the scan may be inconclusive if baby is in awkward position, and you might need a repeat. Part 7. Emotional and Practical Benefits Ultrasounds offer a connection. Seeing the baby for first time helps many parents bond, reduces anxiety. Provides reassurance, confirmation baby is growing, development looks normal. That peace of mind is huge. Helps planning, knowing baby's position, placenta placement, estimating due date helps expectant parents and medical team prepare. Part 8. Common Concerns and Questions Are ultrasounds dangerous? No evidence of risk when done for medical reasons. How accurate are they? Generally very accurate, but image quality depends on technician skill, baby's position, mother's body type, e.g. higher BMI can reduce clarity. Some findings may be false positives or false negatives. Will seeing my baby often make me worry? Sometimes scans detect something ambiguous, which can cause stress. 
but many findings are normal or resolve. Discuss fully with your doctor. Keepsakes or unnecessary scans. Medical guidance generally advises against using ultrasound solely for keepsake videos because of possible overexposure. Part 9. What you should know as a parent. Ultrasound is a powerful, safe, non-invasive tool to check on your baby's health and development. There are different types, 2D, 3D, 4D, Doppler, each with its uses. Use them when guided by medical need, avoid casual overuse just for fun. Stay informed, ask your provider what they're looking for during your scan, understand what they tell you. Enjoy those moments, hearing the heartbeat, seeing the baby move, is special, and you have every right to share in that joy. Thank you for joining me on this ultrasound journey. If you found this helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more pregnancy tips, and hit the bell so you don't miss when we explore your baby's next big milestone. Remember, seeing your baby on that screen is wonderful, but knowing why it matters makes it even more powerful.